Trust and trustworthiness. It's no accident. And we start talking when Stephen Covey talks about this. He talks about the, the trust issue as a, as a cornerstone for change. Because if we don't trust the leaders, if we don't trust the people with the vision, we're not going to be willing to take the, the risks that are going to go with it. So I just put that up there because I think we have to step back from the question of leadership once in a while and say, yes, we need it. It is about change. It is about going to a place we've never been. It is about trust and so forth. And I think those are some of the things that we, we have to consider in this. Now, having said that, let's go forward with a couple of other big ideas and then lock it into the effective schools. The second uh, big concept I want to talk about is a, a definition of a system. A system is a network of interdependent components that work together to accomplish the aim of the system. That's W. Edwards Deming 101. A system is a network of interdependent components that work together to accomplish the aim of the system. So if you just look at that, you say, okay, what's the first thing that's a prerequisite? What do you have to have going forward to even talk about whether or not we have a viable system? The answer is you can't get out of the gate without having a clear understanding of what is the aim of the system. And right now, I believe there is as much confusion about what is the primary aim of the system as anything. We've got all kinds of people pulling the wagon in a lot of different directions, and we have to clarify the aim. My point about the system is, goes as follows. From the point that a child gets on the school bus in the morning in front of his or her home, all the way through that school day, and on the way home at night till he or she gets off the bus, so to speak, speak at the end of the day, that child has interacted with several, many components of an interdependent system.